the field of cell biology that we have today, we owe it to uh, Dr. Pallada and Dr. Farquhar to have opened that window for the rest of us. My husband, George Pallotti, was recruited to be Dean of Science, and I was recruited to be chair of the new Department of Basic Science, which ultimately became the Department of Cellular and Molecular Medicine. So our vision for the future was to strengthen the basic sciences and to build, in, in my case, to build this new department. She was looking at secretory vesicles, uh, the Golgi stacks, uh, the, the structure, the function, and it's because of her contributions over the years that we now have much more insight into how does it look like, how does it function, how does it package little proteins into little uh, vesicles and send it out out of the cell. During my entire youth, I had planned to go into medicine to work with patients. But when I started studying disease, I became very interested in the mechanisms. The disease themselves were affecting humanity, but little was known about mechanisms of disease at the time, and so I thought it would be exciting to try to understand what became the cellular and molecular basis of those diseases. She's always done the thing that she thought would take us farther in that direction of going upwards, whether it is trying to recruit people, whether it's trying to train the next generation of people. She enabled the women scientists around her. Uh, what I learned is a style of mentoring that um, set me up to be a mentor myself. I think mentoring is important because each scientist has a finite life, and but the people we train represent the future, the future of science, and they create future progress. When we came to UCSD, we came here because we thought this would be the, a very exciting place to be for the next 10 years. And as each 10 years passed, we could repeat that. And therefore, I think the next 10 years are going to be just as exciting as the last 26 since we came. Receiving the Revell Medal is the highlight of my career because these 26 years at UCSD have been so exciting, so rewarding, and to be recognized with this highest honor was a very unexpected and very appreciated honor. <laughs>